Hi, Peter King from Lions Camp in Allen Park, Michigan, right outside of Detroit. Three quick observations after watching the Lions, one of my sleeper teams in the NFL this year. Number one, big loss for the Lions. Mikel LaShore on a, just a normal practice play out here today, suffers a torn Achilles tendon, and he'll be out for the year, won't be back until 2012. It's gonna put an awful lot of pressure on Matthew Stafford to do more with his tight ends. Okay, especially Pettigrew, but I thought that Tony Scheffler had a good day out here in practice today. May do more with Tony Scheffler, but there's no question that this offense wants to put Matthew Stafford in position to do things shorter than just always going downfield to Calvin Johnson. Number two, chemistry with Calvin Johnson off the charts for Matthew Stafford. I think a real big thing, a big emphasis with him in the offseason both down in Atlanta, where they both live in the offseason, Stafford and Calvin Johnson, got together a lot, at least once a week, to throw the ball, even when the lockout was in full swing. And by the way, Stafford says totally healthy, shoulders no concern, no pain whatsoever, any part of his arm or shoulder. Third thing, I think it's really going to be interesting to see how Jim Schwartz and the defensive staff, led by Gunther Cunningham, take care of Endomic and Sue. Last year, played so many snaps, played 90% of the snaps on defense. It's a concern of Jim Schwartz's, told me this here, that he doesn't want Endomic and Sue to get used to playing at that high level. He said, you can be more productive playing fewer snaps. I think that's a vital thing that they develop either fairly when he comes off his injury. Fairly, by the way, that he should be back for the opener. He's got his foot in a walking boot right now. Uh, after having a stress fracture, but also to get guys like Corey Williams to make sure that he plays at least 500, 550 snaps to take the pressure off Endomic and Sue. At the end of the day, I like the Lions. I've got to make a decision in a couple of weeks whether to pick them for the playoffs. I've been bull bullish on them so far, and I think I'm going to like them when I have to make my choice. In Allen Park, Michigan, for Sports Illustrated, I'm Peter King.